All right, welcome back to One Bar and Lupagus Show. I am Lupagus. This time for your Saturday evening roster moves by Minnesota Vikings, brought to you by Happy Nuts. Uh, yeah, I mean, Vikings making uh, two interesting moves today. We're going to talk about those. Before we do, mention this video is brought to you by Happy Nuts. Hell yes. Thank you for sponsoring this, Happy Nuts. Uh, guys, we link in the description. Get yourself some comfort powder spray. I was out all day in like 75 degree weather, cutting trees, hauling them out. Uh, when you when you do that, you get sweaty. Little chafers happen, but you know what? This thing saved me so much. Little spray, boom, cools, relieves. You feel ready to roll. Uh, comfort powder spray. I cannot high, I cannot recommend this enough. It's fantastic. Also, to give away a little uh, trifecta this month: comfort cream, comfort powder, and refresher spray. So I will be giving that out at the end of the month to uh, one of you lucky viewers. Again, links in the description for your comfort powder spray. Thank you. Happy nuts. Let's talk about the roster moves. And there's two that uh, they are both kind of exciting. Uh, we had some injuries. Uh, as you know, Nick Muse is out of this one. So to replace Nick Muse, Vikings had a couple options. They could have gone with Robert Tunyon. Or they could have gone with Nikhil Harry. And they go with Bob freaking Tunyon. Bob Tunyon will be active tomorrow as your third tight end. And tight end kind of the position's kind of been forgotten. The Vikings passing attack. I think uh, there were like three receptions between the two in week one. I think Johnny Munt had a couple last week. So not a real, uh, real viable part of this offense right now. But Bob, Bob Tonyan, definitely a pass catcher. We'll see if he can spark that or not. And then, then on the defensive side, Dallas Turner, our rookie phenom, is out. Uh, maybe just for embarrassment for what he did on that punt. But replacing him is Bo Richter. I'm going to get an erection just thinking about this. Didn't it go Audrey Carter? No, 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 no. He said, no, it's Bo Richter time. So another home run for Quasey. Uh, again, I always assumed that Richter would see some playing time. I didn't think it would come in week three. Uh, calling up to the big times already. I love it. Bo Richter. What, what does that guy do? He gets after the passer. May not be good in many other areas, but I wouldn't be surprised if he gets a couple pressures, even a sack tomorrow. Because uh, I think he will be part of this rotation. If he's just going to take over Dallas Turner's spot, Obviously, Jihad Ward, we bumped up the depth chart a little bit. Um, so maybe it goes, you know, maybe Jones is taking Turner's reps, and then it's Ward, and then maybe Richter gets in there, and maybe he's more of the Jihad Road, Ward. See a couple snaps. Um, but I think he's making the most of them, and I'm very excited to see what the Richter scale, the E-Richter, can do tomorrow. So those are your Saturday night roster activations, moves, tweaking this, massaging this roster by the Vikings, calling up Bob freaking Tunyon. And Bo, the Erichter, Richter, uh, it's absolutely fantastic. Cannot wait to watch both those guys make their debuts in purple tomorrow against the Texans. Win the Vikings, go 3-0. and oh. Don't forget, thank you, Happy Nuts, for sponsoring this video. Also, link in the description. Get yourself some comfort powder spray, and you can thank me later for that. And keep your skull in your home.